What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. It looks like I'm in the middle of the desert because I'm actually a king of the hammers 2023. And no, I don't have a sick off-road rig, but I'm actually here with a company that I work for, which is Lee Johnson Ford. And they partner with some pretty big names in the industry, such as Celine Performance Parts, TSW, which stands for Texas Shockworks, which they do a ton of really rad stuff with Ford Raptors. And we did something pretty crazy. We took a brand new Ford Lightning all-electric truck and put Raptor suspension on it. But let's stop talking about it and let's check it out. All right, guys, so we've just finished the first event of Optima Unplugged, which is a brand new event here at King of the Hammers for the EV vehicles. Now, this is a Lee Johnson Ford, Celine Performance Parts, and TSW off-road Ford Lightning with Ford Raptor suspension. And it wasn't just an exact swap, but if you wanna see more on this video, I actually already made a video for the Ford channel, and you can check that out right here. So some of the OEM parts used from a Gen 2 Ford Raptor were the spindles, uh, which bolted right on, but then Celine uh, made some billet upper control arms and Texas Shockworks used Fox DSC or dual speed compression shocks to make this vehicle literally function like a Ford Raptor. And the big question was always in the rear because it is independent rear suspension. They had to make a custom lower eyelet to make everything work. And we're literally out here testing this thing out for the first time in the EV space. So earlier today, part of Optima Unplugged, we actually took it and drag raced it against a bunch of other EVs, including these Rivians and even a new Ford Raptor R. Now I can't say exactly what happened because Optima Batteries will be releasing that video soon, but it was a ton of fun. It was hosted by a really awesome person. You guys might know him, but I'll keep that a little secret for now. But we're here at the King of the Hammers, so let's walk around the vendor area and see what's in store. All right, now that was a lot of really cool stuff in this vendor area and a lot of really cool custom vehicles and custom builds. Now, I didn't see a lot of uh, Dodge trucks, which is kind of what I was looking for, maybe some pre-runners on display, but I know for a fact there's some out there running, but I did come across this. A Jeep CJ7. Yep. And this one looks mostly all original with the hard top. It's got a little crack in it. It's got the hard doors, but seeing one this close to original is actually pretty refreshing and you can see it's a california jeep cj7 so it's probably rust free as well got some stuff up in here probably for overlanding or off-roading missing the dash pad but i just thought there was a neat little gym cj7 you know you guys see mine on the channel kind of did the same thing uh full-blown resto on it and it's just a fun little cruiser but it's just cool to see an old rig out here amongst all these other crazy new rigs these razors are running everywhere polaris's you name it Three hours later. All right, so the night's progressing. You can hear the music behind me. I couldn't get a lot of footage at Chocolate Thunder because there was just so many people. But now I'm at this other spot called Backdoor, and it is freaking gnarly. Let's check it out. Driver, go!
day two. All right, guys, so it's the next day. We had a lot of fun last night over, I forgot what that thing was called. Cause I know we did Chocolate Thunder, then we went to Back Door, and that was super rowdy. They did invite us back out because they're gonna have like some kind of party out there. But right now we are on day two of the Optima Unplugged with the LJSV, Celine, and TSW Ford Lightning R, which is just what I'm calling it in all the videos, Lightning Raptor. And we're actually doing a 20 mile poker run today with nothing but EVs. And we're gonna go to some of the hot spots of King of the Hammers as well. So hopefully I can get some really cool footage. Now, looking around, I see a Tesla on some like all terrains and a ton of Rivians around me. So let's take a look here real quick. Got the TSW tow rig here, our Lightning. And then it's just Rivian, 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 and then this Tesla with all terrains. Scroop just pulled out from this beautiful view out here. And it's really funny because you can hear all the gas powered vehicles in the background, but as the EV groups go by, there's just no noise. And <laughs> my Uber is here. <laughs> Let's go. All right, I didn't talk about this earlier, but it's actually a poker run, right? So at each stop, you pick up a card. So at the end of this, you should get three cards and then everybody reveals their hand. So we got 10 of spades and uh, we'll see what's going on. I'm finally in the driver's seat. I'm finally driving something. Okay, hold on, I really want to see. <clears throat> I love those guys you keep side of me. Okay, cool. Alright, so we're gonna let the lightning R ahead and the rest of the electric crew uh, catch up to the play trail vehicle. But uh yeah, Alex, if you wanna guide me on one I can romp it, let me know. Send it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that's what we're gonna do. driving the Bronco. That's probably the least amount of action that Bronco's gotten, but because it's not mine, I really don't want to beat on it. I'll leave all that up to Alex, Swappy Poppy, and Jeff. Uh, but it's a ton of fun. I mean, we went through some really soft sand, so you really got to stay in it and stay in the power band on the Bronco, but it's actually just a two wheel drive. It's super capable. So we're actually at the last stop of the poker run. So Dan's grabbing all his cards and uh, see what happens. Looks like we got some food for us. I thought it was at the last stop. I was wrong. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and grub up and see what's up with this poker game. All right, guys, that is going to wrap up this video out at King of the Hammers 2023 with Ford on this one. Leaf Johnson Ford, Celine Performance Parts, TSW Off-Road with the Leaf Johnson Ford, Raptor Suspension Swaps, Ford Lightning. Guys, it's been a ton of fun. Uh, I got a busy schedule this year, doing a lot of different events. Up next on the calendar, March 25th, we are Mopar 2023. I'll be there with the uh, Goodrich, be taking the TRX, Challenger won't be out there on this one but we're still working on the car, more videos to come, new suspension components, definitely beefing the car up, manual transmission swap, and some other goodies. That's gonna wrap up today's video, guys. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, leave a comment below, let me know what you think or what else you wanna see on my channel. As always, I'm a car lover, love all automobiles, including Ford, Chevy not so much, but that's all right. So let me know what you wanna see on the channel and uh, we'll keep going to these events, keep doing some more driving, a little more off-roading, uh, thank you guys. Love you guys. Till next time. Peace out.